The country is divided over the killing of police officers by civilians and vice versa. Fear runs deep, even in small town Conway. There's so much going on in this world, so much evil. Tiffany Block, a mother of four, was no exception. That is, until she says she had a revelation at the gym. And I just felt the Lord speaking to me um, while on one of the machines that I needed to go and extend love to an officer. Block says she told herself she wouldn't go seek out an officer, but if she happened upon one, she would speak to them and show them some love. A few minutes later, she spotted Officer Heath Edens in his patrol car at a local grocery store. At that time, my kids were in the car, uh, three out of the four, and they were very nervous. They were scared um, with everything that's been going on. They started crying and they said, Mom, what are you doing? Don't do that. We don't want you to die. The pair talked about the struggles they each face every day, especially in the current climate. We have so much more in common than we have, um, than we're different. People, all races, just want to be heard. I wanted to show them that I'm just like them. I'm, I'm normal. Um, I've just so happened to wear a uniform to protect them and the rest of the public. Just a few kind words and some police badge stickers. That's all it took, Brock says, for Officer Edens to change her kids' minds about law enforcement. Block posted the story on Facebook and has gotten hundreds of shares and comments, inspiring her to begin the Love Matters movement. That's what we need in today's climate and in today's world is just having general conversations, us as, as and the public seeing us as normal citizens, that we're normal human beings. We have loved ones, friends and family, just the same as everybody else. In Conway, Winnie Wright, THV 11 News.